New at 10, the city of Tempe is looking to put the brakes on speeders who are wreaking havoc and wrecking homes in one part of that city. For years, people living in Tempe along Hardy Drive between Baseline and Guadalupe said cars have sped and plowed right into their homes. Well, now the city is rolling out a plan to help curb that problem. 12 News journalist Jonathan McCall in Tempe with the story. Jonathan. The city of Tempe says it is now in the early stages of a redesigned project to cut down on speeding along Hardy Drive between Baseline and Guadalupe. Thursday night, the city meeting with the public here at Wood Elementary School to get feedback and to show off potential solutions to the problem that could be in the works. Folks who live in this area say this problem has been decades in the making. We got a chance to talk with Martha Mingua, who says she has lived in her home in the area since 1978 along Hardy. And she says her family is terrified to sleep in one part of her home. We have had at least two cars going south on Hardy that either were going to make the turn on the Watson, don't know what put them in our front yard, but they ended up in our front yard and had we not had a big tree that they hit in the front yard, they would have hit my daughter's bedroom. Jeff Broman says he sees this problem all day, every day. I mean, I watch the traffic on there all day long and people are going 40, 45, 50 miles an hour. And if you slow down, they'll like get into the middle lane to go around you. Like many here in attendance Thursday night, he says he too has had a car plow through his home. If I was downstairs when the car hit my house, I probably wouldn't be here today because the glass was every in every room of the house. The city of Tempe is now looking to curb the problem. Our goal really is to work with the residents to slow the street down and make it safe. Shelly Seiler with the city of Tempe says a project to slow down speeders now in the early stages. Some of the ideas being proposed include adding speed tables, medians to center lanes, and modifying curbs with landscaping. Folks who live in this area say despite the challenges, they don't plan to go anywhere. I'm there till God comes. But they do hope something can be done before then to make them feel safe in their homes. The city of Tempe says money has already been designated for this project. Construction is set to get underway sometime in 2026. But before then, they'll spend the next year looking at possible designs and the best solutions for this project and the area. That's where the public can now share their thoughts on what they believe would be the best idea. We'll have details on how you can do that right now at 12news.com.